Hello everyone, I'm Bob. In the past decade, we have launched some iconic products and gained a lot of popularity. We are so proud to see happy riders across the world riding on wheels. And we appreciate all your support and trust along the way. Making better wheels has always been the most important thing that we are striving for. And today, I'm honored to share with you two of our exciting new products. First, let's talk about our EUC of the year, Emotion Challenger. Extreme wheels are happening to many riders, but Emotion Team has been cautious about making those high performance wheels. Before we feel confident enough about safety, we cannot move forward. Today is the day. I'm proud to say Challenger is the answer. Riders will no longer need to sacrifice safety to enjoy the pure excitement of riding. As the most powerful EUC on the market, Challenger is 22 inch, 126 wattage suspension wheel, equipped with battery packs of 3,024 watt hour, smart BMS, and our most advanced controller Raptor. It has insane lift up speed of 140 km per hour. From today, extreme wheels will be redefined. Next, I will dive into the details and structure this presentation into four parts. First, we will talk about the overall design, the insights of our design philosophy, and the basic features. Then, we will talk about the free and modular design concept. How the battery packs, controller, motor, and the lights attached to the frame. In the third segment, we'll talk about the safety that includes three most important components. The motor. Why it can produce such tremendous power and acceleration. The battery. What new technology we have implemented to make it durable and safe. Raptor controller. Why is it different? How this next generation concept helps Challenger to achieve high performance with the cutout issues. And last, we'll talk about the suspension. What's the difference with the V11 design? How to convert it to a non-suspension wheel? In any case, let's get into it. Challenger is a big suspension wheel, which is built like a tank, strong and tough. It's super stable and comfortable to ride at a high speed. It's a catalytic. The width of the wheel is less than 200 millimeters, which means it's still agile enough to maneuver. We implemented our family trolley handle to Challenger, which is easy to use. The highly pressed touchscreen display, which is the same as our retail series has been adopted here. You can read the key information and change the settings easily from the screen. Rolling cage is not only to protect your wheel from damage, but also serves as a lift handle when you need to lift your wheel up to your trunk or a few stairs. The 18 watt headlight and 1 watt rear light makes the wheel very visible at night. It has two charging ports that can support up to 1,754 watt, which means you can fully charge your battery within two 
and a half hours. One Type-C port and one USB port are available so that your phone or your tablet have an easy way to charge up. A big and wide marker is provided so you never need to worry about the puddles anymore. Power pads are free accessories for everyone. And all you need to do is to pace it to wherever fits you the best to prevent potential damage to the corners of the outer shells. We have added four protective armor made out of stainless steel. In this way, the outer shells and the battery packs inside are well protected from unintentional impacts or punctures. Super big and wide spiked pedals are equipped with chamber. And the height and the angles are adjustable. So play with it. You will find out your sweet spot eventually. Challenger is built up on a modular design concept that helps make the maintenance very friendly. The inner frame is the basic structure of the whole wheel and everything else is added up easily. We know the most frequent DIY need might be tire replacement. As for Challenger, you don't need to break down the wheel into pieces to be able to do so. Just pull out the motor and start replacing. The time cost of the whole process could be reduced to 30 minutes. Trolling handle, rolling cage, front and rear light, battery packs, all those modules could be removed directly from outside with very few companies. Raptor is the first of its kind as an EUC controller with independent sealed shells and integrated connectors. The controller package is very easy to install and dismount. Compared to Emotion Recalc, the total assembly time cost of the Emotion Challenger is reduced by 60%, which would be a great relief for everyone. So say goodbye to the mess of breakdown and begin to enjoy the easy mod in your own garage. Safety is always our top priority. We have made a lot of efforts and improved to the motor, battery, and controller. Apply the latest technology to make every ride fun and safe. As the most powerful motor ever made for EUC, Challenger's motor is 124 voltage, equipped with a 22 inch buffalo tire, 282 mm diameter stator, 38 H magnetic steel, which enables the motor to achieve a lift speed of 140 km per hour, a rate of power by 4500 watts. A peak power by 10,000 watt. A max torque by 300 newton meter. It's safe to say that the Challenger will conquer any use with ease and travel at any speed with a promising safety margin. To allow the motor to get enough input current, we used eight AWG phase conductor cables double the size of their counterparts that can sustain 160 amp continuous current and 1000 amp peak current. The heat will be reduced by 75%, which means riders can do more extreme ridings without concerning damaging the wires, as its predecessors is a hollow motor. Well, so IPX6 waterproof level. Just enjoy the freedom of riding. No need to worry about the water or dust getting inside. With reinform rim design, it can support vertical impact up to 2,700 kilograms, which is two times of the value of V12 HT. To provide extra safety guarantee, we implemented redundant power sensor system. 
the riding experience will be much smoother because right now the motor could be controlled much more precisely. In case either one fails while riding, the other one can take over the task to make sure no cutouts occurs. Challenger's battery is 126 voltage, 3024 watt hour capacity. The packs are IP67 waterproofing level and can support fast charging up to 1764 watt. Next, I'd like to share more insights about the Smart BMS and our safety tactics. Smart BMS is one of the major updates for Challenger. So now you can check the status of every parallel cells, which is also monitored by the motherboard all the time. Cells balancing technology has been adopted too, which can decrease the battery aging process and extend the lifespan by 100%. A dedicated voltmeter has been implemented in the BMS with a deviation down to 3%. So now you have a much better understanding of how much power is left in your wheel. Independent battery bugs are very important for the analysis in case of failure. So now the emotion team can dive into every failure case, come up with a solution and then update the BMS fit firmware for every rider via OTA to prevent potential risks. Battery safety is always our top design priority to ensure the battery cells are sturdily fixed. We have designed strong inner bracket to hold them. In addition, the whole pack is submerged by silicon to reinforce the structure strings and make it water resistance. In addition, heat is well spread, so it can last much longer for heavy duty riding without constant overheating. To prevent the damage to the corners of the shelves, we have added four protected shoes. In this way, the Challenger's battery is fully armed with 11 by 2 temperature sensors and 12 type of protection mechanisms. The Challenger battery has the most sophisticated safety tactics on the EUC market. To prevent potential failure during charging, we have designed a redundant protection mechanism in the BMS. Either one fails, the other one can still work independently. In addition, there is a third protection layer outside the battery pads. So even all the battery BMS protection functions fail, there will still be a gatekeeper to prevent potential fires. Challenger adopts our unique TCS technology. The two battery packs communicate with each other and also with the motherboard simultaneously. In case any one channel fails, the motherboard can still monitor all the battery status from the other communicating channels. Let's move to the next important the controller. The controller serves as both the heart and brain of an electric speed cycle. In our case, it tracks the real time status of the wheel through sensors, it controls battery current, gets the motor working, monitor all performance, and perform protective actions to reduce the RC in advance. Let's have a look at the internal structure and design of the controller, which have a name Raptor. Let's get started. Raptor controller is our first modular concept of design, aiming to provide a big safety margin, compact and clean wiring management. IPX5 waterproofing, independent packaging, and easy maintenance. Raptor con controller mainly consists of three layers. These are the outer shell, driver board, and the thermal conductive board. The assembly is well sealed without any jump wire inside or outside, so it can be easily tested and transported. Motorcycle grid waterproofing connectors are integrated 
with the uh, PCBA. You know, easy to plug in and out. To ensure the driver board always has enough safety margin under any extreme conditions, we decided to use 42 MOSFETs with a moderate withstand voltage of 200 voltage. That's 58% more than the Challenger's peak voltage, allowing for nearly 100 amp continuous current. This means the Challenger can provide tremendous acceleration and deceleration without damaging the board. 18 capacitors are adopted, which is six times of its predecessor. It generates much less speed, especially on uneven terrain, and the system is generally safer and reliable. It also reduces the impact of the stress and it extends the lifespan of the battery pack. All the MOSFETs are installed directly on the thermal conductive board, and two independent fans are used to cool down the board. A no cutout experience is what we are striving for, and wrapper is made for this mission. Three years ago, we released the first suspension wheel in Motion V11 which still is one of the best cruising wheel up to date. For Challenger, the suspension system just got better. The unsprung mass of the Challenger is only motor and sliders, reduced by 20% compared to its last generation. Two sets of independent air shocks and dampers are implemented on each side, so you can adjust the pressure and the dampering speed according to your weight and your riding preference. It's super responsive to uneven trains, and I can guarantee that you have never had the same smooth riding experience elsewhere. We know some of you prefer non-suspension wheels. With Challenger, you can easily transfer it to a non-suspension model by removing the suspension keys. So just play around you will feel the two different characters of the same wheel. Alright, that's what I'd like to share with you guys today about the Motion Challenger. One more thing. So we have known everything about our EC. Now let's talk about our scooter. Clever. You may have the impression that scooters are just toys for kids. Well, things have been changed since the year of 2017. From when shared scooters began to gain millions of adopters. More and more people realize that it's an investment rather than amusement to purchase an electric scooter. Because they can easily be paid off by saving on gas, parking fees, and car maintenance costs. It's a clear trend that Electric scooter is becoming a tour instead of a toy. But most of the products are not able to tackle the challenges like power, reliability, waterproofing, maintenance, etc. And that's exactly the reason why we came up with the ideas of Cliver. As the name speaks for itself, Cliver is a powerful scooter equipped with dual motors with max power up to 1,500 watt. So, why dual motors? Isn't a single wheel motor enough? Yes and no. For people who live in flat tires, the single motor scooters might just be enough. But for those who live in hay areas, single motor scooters just can't do the job. Once you climb a slight hill, by a steel motor scooter. You don't want to get back to single ones because of the weak power. The speed will drop to somewhere you'd rather walk, which is very embarrassing and unpleasant. That being said, with Climber, you can climb any hills you see. California Street in San Francisco, not a problem. We know that a lot of people are so relying on their scooters and they just can't accept the fact that their scooters can be easily damaged in the rain or passing some light puddles. To 
To solve this problem, we make timer have a water room level of IPX6, which is the best in the personal electric scooter category. For key components like battery and control units, they have an even higher water room level of IP67. Climber is the best water resistant personal electric scooter. And we care what you care about. It's been a disaster to maintain a scooter. Even a simple task like replacing a tire might need to purchase special tools, remove 30 plus screws, mess up everywhere, take up hours of labor. With Climber, all those hassles will become history. Thanks to our modular design and split ring technology. To make a higher change, you just need to plug off the connector, remove the motor, split the rings, and replace your new tire. Display, stem, motor guard, you'll find all those modules are very easy to replace, just like changing tires. You don't need to wait to get your scooter serviced from your dealer or retailers anymore. Just enjoy the pleasant maintenance experience in your grass from today. 90% of manufacturers claimed smart BMS are fake on the current electric scooter market, but Kyber is not one of them. Like Challenger, Kyber has a similar smart BMS. You can check out the status of every pair of cells, which is also monitored by the controller all the time. Cell balancing technology has been adopted too, which can decrease the battery aging process and extend the lifespan by 100%. So now, your scooter just has the same level of safety and reliability Reliability is a key for a tour. Climber has a simple but sturdy construct, which can sustain a max load up to 140 kilograms. Along with the top-notch battery cells, redesigned motors, and well-tested controller, Climber will be one of the most reliable scooter on the market. And eventually, you will find that this scooter can keep it valid for a long time, which is exactly the goal of our design for this scooter. To summarize, Climber is a scooter for people who live in hilly areas and need more power. It's a fun, powerful, water resistance, easy maintenance, and reliable tour rather than just a toy. There's one thing for sure. Once you step on it, 